on guys welcome back to some more content on the channel i really wanted to thank you guys for the support on the previous videos you know the views are kind of low for the past couple of days but they're starting to kind of pick up now so i really appreciate the support as you guys can see up here we're really close to 600k so i really appreciate if you guys can subscribe and not subscribed already tell your friends man tell your friends and your granny and your auntie kid you know what i'm saying before i have to take out the belt and go to your crib and just whip you real quick uh, oh, it's no. either that or you, you're just gonna straight up catch his hands guys so what are you, <laughs> what are you waiting for man let's get a 600k baby so today's video we're gonna play a game called anime artifact simulator it's legitimately a brand new anime game that a lot of people are saying in the community has a bunch of similarities between itself and anime fighter simulator now if you guys don't know anime fighter simulator right now is currently unavailable like you cannot play it it's been privated because of uh supposedly copyright reasons and we don't know when that game is coming back but i'll tell you what i do know and that's that you guys gotta go ahead and follow me on twitter man come on man we're close to 15k i'm trying to break 15k followers on twitter too so just please follow me on twitter but yeah without further ado we're gonna dive into this anime artifact game and see what it's all about <laughs> Texas on screen right now. You swore that you would like the video, and now you have to do it, guys. Thanks so much. <laughs> Love you guys. I'm gonna catch you later. Just want to remind you guys to subscribe to the channel real quick and turn on those post notifications so you're notified of all my uploads. All right, so we can choose what sword to start off with. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, this is a pretty cool sword, but I think we'll go with the traditional standard katana. So let's pick this sword. And so I do hear like, huh? Yeah, the game does have music playing in the background. It's just very, very small. I like how um, what should I say? Anime SSS. Heck, can I go in here? I can't. But yeah, I, I like how the game looks. It's like very, very vibrant. Uh, I don't know how to pull up the menu at all. Like, I only know how to pull up the gold shop. <laughs> what the heck? Demon Slord. I mean, Demon Slayer. Sword 1, Damage 2. We have a bunch of... Oh, damn. Okay, so they have Bleach, One Piece, and Demon Slayer. All right, so I'm not really understanding. Uh, they have, like, donations over here. I can honestly be at the top of the leaderboard if I donate more than 3,200. But whatever, I'm not going to do that. You know what I'm saying? I, and actually, why do I start off with seven coins? Like, does everybody start off with seven coins? Because, oh, look at this guy, Mr. Loud909010, man. He wants to he wants to be, like, Loud, a.k.a. Lou the Real Gamer. <laughs> you know, some people call me Loud a Gamer, not Lou the Real Gamer. I, I don't understand why, but, you know. Anyway, uh, I don't have any of this stuff. There's like a giant sword over here. We have a demon slayer teleport and then a teleport in general. Let's see. Sword town, demon slayer. Uh, let's just go to the portal. Um, so what do we do? Do we just like attack demons and stuff? Okay. All right. Well, I just completed. Well, I just defeated my first demon. Let me, let me, uh, type in music. Does that work? No. Does music off work? Damn it. It doesn't work. Nothing works. I'm so upset. Well, I don't know, boys. I don't know if you guys will be able to hear the game's audio for this video. Uh, Cause I mean, the music is very, very, very low so maybe i might be able to get away with like just the music being played but uh my music my own music overlaps it i don't know so we have katanas over here i guess uh this is all rng and it's a spin thing um there's mythical katanas for 0.5 rarity uh 300 gold for every spin so i can't do that because i don't have enough cash but uh i can kill this temple demon real quick though all right cool stuff so i'm really kind of just confused right because it's like okay you know we have these guys that we can kill uh and then we have like a mini boss so in a way I, I can tell why people are comparing this to anime fighters because I mean just look at how the enemies are spread out That's pretty much what you do in anime fighters. It's just a different concept it's, Instead of you having your your team follow you around to kill the NPCs You're the one that's actually doing it right now It's funny because these guys don't actually fight back as you can tell clearly. So yeah, I don't know matter of fact I can pay to win so 240,000 cash <laughs> I was really about to play like a free to play noob. Boys, like, <laughs> come on now, cut. All right, so all these characters are locked. I don't know how to unlock them, but uh, we're definitely gonna go ahead and spin for this here. Oh, okay. It says our damage went up. So it, DMG went up to four in the left hand corner here. So we're gonna keep opening. And uh, okay, we keep getting damage too. I don't know what that means. Maybe the more duplicate katanas you get, the higher the damage for that katana goes. I, I don't know. We'll just, uh, we'll see. But we'll keep it pushing for the time being, you know? I wish there was like a a multiple open oh you know what 
Wait a minute. Okay, we got our first rare right here. Let's check if the... Oh, the game doesn't have any game passes as of right now. All right, you know what? I think I'm going to open like five more, and then we're going to go ahead and... Oh, the, the sword is five stars, 10%. Yes, yeah, so you see, I, I was right. I think I was right. I think if you get duplicates of a certain item, it'll actually upgrade that item even more for you, and it'll do... Oh, we got an epic. Nice. But yeah, you'll ultimately end up doing more damage. All right, boys. So let me go... Ah, all right. Yeah, so that's how it works works so basically what will happen is okay for example i have Munita sword right then i go back in here and get inusuke sword out you guys can see that this is how you're gonna unlock of these characters or the swords for these characters it's just simply by spinning on the swords so Senny's, uh sword is also another one that i have now do i do more damage with him that's the thing like for example right now i do 33 damage 50 damage 33 right but then if i equip let's say tanjiro sword which looks very very cool and has some really cool effects uh does that do 33 50 33 50 same amount of damage uh inusuke let's see 33 50 33 50 33 50 all right yeah so i don't not really quite too sure what's the point in maxing out the stars by getting duplicates but uh i think we'll find out later into the game as for right now though uh let me just kill this character all right never mind that was pretty easy and let me help out this sad noob over here that's free to playing and is struggling to kill off this guy look at that <laughs> sucks to suck kid matter of fact kid <laughs> Damn, Anyways, um, we're gonna get on out of here. I don't think we really need to be like Muzan's down over there. Uh, I guess fine. I can try to kill Muzan so we can kill one of each enemy in this map before moving on. But yeah, I don't think we really need to be here anymore, uh, or any longer than what we've been here for. I can clearly try to like max out uh all of these losers. <laughs> demon slayer dimension like i can try to get all these characters but i don't know i probably won't all right i'm not gonna lie i'm not even gonna try to kill muzan because man's is giving me like barely any coins so yeah the next island you actually have to spend twenty thousand gold coins to unlock and this is the bleach area uh so we can spin for zanpak toes okay yes i might as well well actually i don't really need to do this either because i can probably already buy my way into the very very next area so let's see i mean they don't even have a dashing uh key in the game this map seems pretty big i think they need to add like definitely mounts or something of the sort right but aside from that like the maps look very very basic but i again i can tell why the game has as many players as it has because it's just anime fighter simulator but from a different perspective and since the game isn't even playable right now people are just gonna be flocking to this game for sure because you know very 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 similar it's not like a copy and paste but obviously very very similar oh i don't even oh damn all right yeah i don't have enough can i reset my character all right cool but yeah let's uh let's try to go ahead and spin then let's waste all our 200k coins just so that we can uh get some good stuff going for ourselves and i will catch you guys in a bit let you guys know what i got all right boys so i've opened a couple of the song puck toes right i obviously still have 145 000 coins left as you can see in the right hand corner but i wanted to explain something to you guys because i figured out you know pretty much how the game works so if you look at the left hand corner i have 118 damage now so if i go in here you guys can see that i actually do have biakuya's legendary song puck toe from the bleach world so basically this game has up to five star rarities for every sword or every item i guess because one piece it can't be possibly swords again right but for every item that you get you know you will have the ability to get duplicates up to a total of five stars after you get the five stars you know you'll get like 10 percent of the cash that you spent for this for the opening the egg or the spin or whatever you want to call it back right because you already have it and that's the max so here's the thing you might be thinking like okay so what's the point in doing that though and the thing is that for every duplicate you get up to five stars you actually get bonus damage that'll add up to your total damage in the left hand corner so that's pretty much how the system works and i can uh i can try to show you guys here i, I don't think you know i'm gonna get like a legendary or an epic right away to show you that's why it, it's, it's gonna be kind of tough but maybe in the starter area since we didn't really get that many good items I could still uh, show you guys that every time we get an item that has not yet reached five stars, it'll add to our overall damage in the left hand corner. So, but that's pretty much how it works. I'm going to keep at it over here uh, just to try my luck and, you know, we'll see how it goes. Actually, let me stop hatching. Let me just see how much damage I do. Let me change my sword to uh, Byakuya's sword. So, Senbon Sakura. Oh, yeah, we kill these guys pretty quickly. Yeah. All right. Yeah. 
so you definitely gain a lot more coins after successfully killing some of these guys so again like i told you since i don't really have that many units from the demon slayer world i might you know have to go back there um and let's go ahead and try to attack okyoto over here because homie's about to die so when he actually dies we should get a bunch of coins let's see we're at 134k and we are at 135 all right so i guess um they do happen to scale your reward based on how much damage you deal to the enemy right now again i'm gonna say it one more time i do think this game needs some sort of a mounting system or if not like a, a um like a dedicated run button or run multiplier button i don't know something yeah okyoto is back here again all right I, this guy has more health so we could do more damage let's see we're at, again we're at 135 136k coins let's see what we get after we come all right boys here we go moment of truth we are at all right 139k so we get like 4k coins from killing okyoto which is not bad now aizen is all the way on the other end over here so we're gonna go ahead and try to kill homie if we can yeah, this man has 30k wow that's crazy all right he has 30k hp so this is gonna take a hot minute but uh i shall be back i'll let you guys know remember we had our let's say by the time we kill aizen we're like 141k which is very unlikely but one let's say yeah 141 probably 141 142 so let's see how high we jump all right boys here we go we're about to kill mr eisen we're at 140 let's see we killed him and we are at 160k so yeah this is gonna take very very long let's see if the uh damn all right i'm gonna have to buy it <laughs> oh they do scale the hell because it says 240k but obviously i got way more than that if you guys look over here i have 640,000 coins i was gonna say like do they scale you know the the coins based on the world that you're at because most simulator games that's what they do and they do do that <laughs> i said do do baby oh but yeah <laughs> that happens to be the case in this game too but they just don't visually represent it so we're gonna buy the next world uh obviously i was not gonna stay in the previous world 20,000 gold per spin here. Dude, what? It's swords too over here. Okay. I mean, I guess. But uh, yeah, I was not going to stay in the previous area. Why is this guy so weak? Like, look how fast I killed him. Oh, Don Flamingo is here too. But yeah, I was not going to stay in the, in the previous world and keep grinding Aizen because that's only 20,000 coins. So, uh, like, and it took me like three to four minutes to kill him. So, I'm not finna free to play, bro. I'm finna pay to win my way through all the worlds, baby. You understand? All right, good. All right, so with that being said and done, uh, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and spend all my money. This time for real, I'm gonna spend all my money, uh, especially because it's gonna go really quick. But we're gonna spend our money on opening all these uh, these weapons here. Now, again, guys, this is a really good time to show you guys the effect of getting duplicates. So, again, look how we're getting duplicates. And even though we're getting duplicates, our damage, our total damage output on the left is going up every time until that item gets to five stars again. So, um, I guess this is a pretty interesting approach to tackling the, the whole like RNG system and the luck mechanic in the game but I don't know I will say it is kind of annoying because it gets to the point that obviously when you have it maxed out like, you don't get nothing you just get 10% of your coins back so it's like you legitimately don't get nothing uh in most other games even though you get a dupe or uh let's say in a simulator game where you have a unit that you already had or gotcha right um at least that dupe unit can be used for something whether it be for xp whether it be to evolve into another unit but in this game you get duplicates and it's like what's the point right so we have sabo's uh little crane thing over here <laughs> i'm not even i'm not even gonna bother with that yeah this is this looks a lot cooler look at this sword but i mean let's see how much damage we're doing now 176 yeah so i guess our damage 264 is a crit but our damage literally is what it is as far as the value in the left hand corner so um yeah i don't know i think this is okay we're gonna try to kill the main boss the dude with the magma i forgot that, guy, that guy's name but um oh no kaido is the main boss in this area at least he should be why the hell would this guy be stronger than kaido oh new map is under construction uh, is it gonna hint what it is no it's not all right so i mean i don't know you guys let me know what you think about this game in the comments below i think the game's all right but it's a very bare bones game like it's it's not wow these guys are so weak man whoa what the hell how's that man attacking that fast and even though he's attacking that fast he's still like very very weak compared to me right so let's see how much we get out of uh killing this guy sakazuki or whatever the hell his name is all right boys here we go we're, we're 16k and as a result, of, a result blah, excuse me as a result of killing him we only got damn 10k coins man that's trash man granted that could very well be because the other guy is on crack like he's <laughs> He's literally attacking super, 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 super duper fast. So let's see Blackbeard. Yo, look at Blackbeard's face. Oh my God, what the hell? But let's see how much we get out of him. All right, boys, here's the moment of truth. We're at 27K and as a result of killing Blackbeard, we get, what the hell, 13K coins. All right, you know what, man? Let me just uh, verify that Kaido is indeed stronger. Because homie over there, I think had like 100K HP. 
right? Let's see how much uh, Kaido has 46. All right, this game is like, are you stupid or what? <laughs> I'm sorry, and I'm not even a. What the hell is this guy doing? Yo, what are you doing, bro? Why are you hiding over here, man? Yo, this guy and that other guy on the other part, man. Yo, these guys are sus. This guy's saying hi. Let me ask him, what are you doing over here? <laughs> hmm? Mr. Uh, suspicious player. Let's see. Let's see what excuse he gives us. He's like, I didn't care. All right, man. This man right here, bro. I, I ain't even going. Uh, man, listen, man. Let me hide your chat box so people don't report you or nothing like that. Oh my God, bro. What the hell, man? I, I don't understand how that guy is attacking so far. Maybe, maybe, right? It could be the case. Maybe you do happen to get to the point where you do a lot of damage, right? I don't know. Maybe that's what it was, right? Not a lot of damage. Obviously, that's the case. But I mean, like, maybe if you get like the best swords fully maxed out for an area your attack speed goes up i don't know all right so we're back at the starter area because i really wanted to verify that that's all the game has to offer um they have codes so i'm gonna try to check that out for you guys if you guys are interested in playing the game but yeah this is this is definitely it like there's really not not nothing else and yeah the top 100 for damage isn't even that high Ten thousand. but how do you get to ten thousand? all right well i don't know well these are the only codes that they have apparently the first one is artifacts let's try yeah there you go we got a thousand uh, gold and the second one is called 100 likes so we got two thousand gold all right that's not really that great but okay <laughs> All right, uh, I'll catch you guys in a bit. I'm going to try to open this for a bit here, and I'll keep you guys posted as far as, like, if we can max this thing out or whatever. Uh, well, this one, right? So I'll be back. All right, guys, I'm not going to lie. I sat here for the past five minutes. <laughs> I only managed to open 8,000 golds uh, worth of ninchidens over here from this egg or from this crystal whatever you want to call it and we managed to go from i don't know what it was but we didn't we didn't really get nothing as you guys can see like this is very 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 boring like either they add like a multi-hatch game pass or an auto open function or i don't know like it's just very 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 boring and like i said there's no incentive to actually get any dupes like it's just like whatever bro like here's 10 percent of your cash back good luck gg keep trying kid you're trash like <laughs> I just feel like, damn, cuz that's it. But uh, no, yeah, I'm gonna wrap up this video here. There's really not much for else for us to do. The game is very bare bones, and to say that it is right now, is it a good game? Eh, it looks good. I think it has potential, but um, I don't, I don't, I don't think it'll last a long time if uh, it's gonna stay in the state that it is in right now. So definitely a lot to be added. Definitely a lot to be done. But for what it is, I guess it's a good game. I'm out of here though, guys.